Yo, it's your boy Jizo back with another video in today. And today, what we're gonna review today. The fuck is this on my screen? Again? All right, so I said what we're gonna review today. It's your boy Jizo back with another video. And today, what we're gonna do is my let's do my top five, top five people, or let's say rappers. Let's do rappers. Let's do all rappers. Top five rappers who inspired uh, 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 me uh, for this jury thing. You know what I mean? Top five, 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 five. Top five rappers who inspired. Uh, uh, basically, I get inspiration from when I do custom pieces. Uh, you know, we got some older guys. We got some newer guys. You know what I mean? How it go? But we can only pick five. So, we're going to start off. It's just, and it's not an order. It's just a, a, a basically, I'm going to just say about five people. I'm going to say five people. I'm going to say about five people. Um, so, let's start off with the main, the first person. First person is definitely going to have to be Slick Rick. Slick Rick is before my time. But... So iconic with the pieces and the chains and things in the jury that even him being before my time, meaning um, when he was out, you know what I mean? We really don't know too many Slick Reek songs, um, <laughs> me personally, but he's a legend. I'm not saying he's not a legend. I know the main songs that everybody hears. Um, I was introduced back to Slick Rick. We heard the, you know, the songs they played on the radio, but Slick Rick became one of um, my favorites when uh, JD, I don't know if you know JD, he dropped the album, he had them on there. And, and that verse on there, I'm fresh, like a million bucks, left a couple of bite marks on the hunt, says I'm fresh. Like, like that, that song was one of my favorite songs, so... And I was a kid then, so I was like, okay, okay, that guy's cool. Then when you when you seen him, he had chains on. So he is a big influence. Like these chains, uh, should I put it in the video? Yeah, I'll just put it in the video. Like these chains right here, man. Iconic. And he inspired everybody. I think he led the way. Um as far as rappers go, you know what I mean? And I don't know if it was him or Mr. T first. So we'll get in that to another story, another day, another time. But so we're going to go with Slick Rick with his jury. Um, and he also tell you how to take your time. If you ever watch his uh, uh, GQ uh, jury collection video uh, on the rocks, whatever it's called. If you ever watch that, you'll see he was telling you how he upgraded his jury and everything like he started off with this and he upgraded and upgraded and upgraded so just take your time with it that's basically what he's saying um again he's one of the guys you know what i mean that so basically if it wasn't for him then nobody really would be weighing outlandish things you get what i'm saying so then you got uh for me for me my slick rig. Um, even though we can argue a point with other people, um, you can argue the point with other people, but my slick rig, my slick rig and my era of my time would be Gucci Man. Hands down will be Gucci Man. You know what I mean? You know his iconic uh Bart Simpson piece, his uh his uh his his his, his uh bacon soda piece. Man, I'm telling you, he had he had so many pieces. He even had a piece with a it was a plate with 1017 in the middle. Man, he had that. Uh, he did so many pieces, big pieces, big 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 pieces. Pause. He did them. He did them. So he's like my generation's version of Slick Rick when it comes to jury. We can put that. He is. He's definitely one of them. He one of them. So then we'll go to the next one. 
and we're gonna have to go for real. We're gonna have to go for real. He 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 did the colorful diamonds. Uh, he did the colorful diamonds. His chains look nice. He had the big piece. He had small pieces. He made things cool. For real, man. We're gonna have to go with that guy. Um, and I'm probably leaving out a few people. So we we got two more people to go. We got two more people to go. And um, I said for real. And this is this is real hard, man. Because for real, for real is like iconic with the pieces. His pieces are so iconic. He actually auctioned them off. The colored diamonds. All that, all the Jacob and Co. stuff that he did is iconic, legendary, so legendary. He got to auction them off. Now we're moving on. We're moving on. Uh, we're moving on. And 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 this is not something I wrote down. This is something I know. These three people are iconic for me, right? These three people are iconic for me, right? So it's like. They're iconic for the times. So if we're going to go for the times, we're going to have to put, if we're going to go iconic for the times. So this generation, I'm going to say this generation, this generation is Slick Rick. So we, we went with Slick Rick. Gucci Man is my generation Slick Rick. Pharrell is damn near the same. Then... Then, like, the newer wave, I'm going to have to go with Sauce Walker. Man. Sauce Walker has a nice jury selection. He has nice pieces. Um, actually, we're going to mention him. Uh, but what about, like, I don't, I don't know if it was his pieces or his, uh, his manager's pieces, too, man. So I'm, pr I'm pretty sure they put together, but... Say what we can say what we want, but the pieces that he get, like that Akuma piece with the fucking uh, 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 the Dragon Ball necklace, the the dragon. Oh my god! Like that is iconic. The the anklet, uh, the bandana anklet, iconic. Um, yeah, he's just iconic, man. Drip, you know what I mean? It is really literally that, you know what I mean? It's literally that. Um, when it comes to him, he has iconic pieces, he changed the game. Uh, he actually tells you, he actually he actually loves the jury, you can tell. He studies it, you can tell. Um, which makes sense if you're gonna keep buying it, you should know what you're buying. So, yeah, shouts out to Sauce Walker, man. And for me right now. For me right now, I'm going to go with the fly guy, man. The fly guy, west side gun, man. Okay, so that so that would be number five. The fly guy, west side gun. West side gun has two of the hardest pieces that I'm like, man, if I copied somebody, I would copy that. I would copy that. Like, I would copy that. And it, it, it is these pieces, right? Is that Doom piece? That Doom piece is tough. But that other piece that he has is like, oh, man. Sheesh. That thing hitting. is hitting, man. It's hitting. It's hitting for real, man. It's hitting. And it looks nice. Like, the quality. The quality that it looks like is great. Um, the quality that it looks to be because I've never seen it in person, so I have to say what it looks to be, and it looks good quality. But the big ass bracelet killed them, killed them on the big ass bracelet. The big ass bracelet, uh, top of the line, man. He's the fly guy, and, and you, you know, he's proven it with the jury that he's the fly guy, man. He is the fly god with these these pieces, man. So again, I'm gonna put all the pieces in the video so y'all can see. Now, that's my top five inspirational rappers with this jury shit. Now, here's what we're gonna start doing. What we're gonna start doing is 
letting you guys come on here with me. So I'm gonna have to start going live. You guys come on with your pieces and we can rate your pieces. We can see what your pieces look like. We can talk about your pieces. You know what I mean? So you bring your piece, you, you get on here. We're going to get on live together. You're going to get on here. You're going to show off your jewelry. You're going to be like, oh, this is what I got. This is what I got. Uh, this is what I got. And we're going to be like, okay. You know what I mean? We're going to be live. So y'all stay tuned for that. Um, what's going to happen is I'm going to go live and I'm going to put the link to be added in the description. That's in the, in the comments. So all you have to do is click that link to get added to the thing. But... That's about it, man. I'm out. Peace.